guys, Tyler Grant with Dynamic Training Strategies with Grant again. And this weekend, when, when Grant took the combat focus shooting class, he was running uh, the Blade Runner from Blade Runner from Edge Tactical. Um, it's if you hopefully hadn't seen the if you hadn't seen the first video from Edge Tactical that I did, go back, stop watching, and watch that video. But Grant, what what is your review? What's your what's your thoughts on these uh, on these iPro right here? You know, based on the the price point of them, um, they're an excellent piece of eyewear. Um, I for my personal taste, um, the shade of lens was ideal. Um, over the last two days, we had a, a variety of light conditions. Uh, it wasn't just your normal sun up, bright and sunny, or a solid overcast. It was constantly changing, and they weren't too dark for uh, those those low lighter, uh, more low light situations. But they weren't um, too light for the brighter conditions. Um, not only that, but they're extremely comfortable. They fit snugly to your head. Um, they don't give you the the um, uh, cranial headache from your um, eyewear or, or uh, earwear going over top and pressing into your skull. Um, what I found as far as fogging, um, they were exceptional. Um, not to say that there wasn't any fogging incidents, but I, to be fair and honest, they were after a day's worth of use. So one full solid long day on the range, zero fog ups, which um, based on my cheekbones, I have a very difficult time finding a pair of eyewear that doesn't fog, um, just and they fit really snug to your head. So great piece of glass, um, and and for these, um, like I said, they, the only time they did fog was in day two. Um, we had a lot of dirt, um, rain, and uh, you know I think it was a matter of, of what got on the lens to create the fogging because day one was just as bad or, or close to and, and just all around price point, um, they're going to be tough to beat.